So to make Irish pot pie, um, it's basically an Irish stew using Irish stout. First thing you're going to do is get some flour and just put some salt and pepper in it. And you're going to be covering the beef um, stew chunks in it. And then you're going to put them right in a really hot skillet just to kind of get them browned a little bit. They don't need to fully cook because um, you will be putting them in the crock pot. Next, you want to put in your vegetables. I put in uh, little fingerling potatoes, carrots, um, onions, garlic, and what you see me here um, putting in is also some parsnips, which are a great Irish vegetable, um, a little bit milder than carrots. So that's a great one if you haven't tried it. You're going to put all of that in your crock pot, so now the meat and the vegetables, and then you're going to put two cups of beef broth, and you're going to mix it with a, a little can of tomato paste and kind of get it good and smooth. Put that in, and next, your Irish stout. Um, you can use any kind of Irish stout, but you're going to use one bottle or one can. And then after you have let it um, be on the crock pot for about six hours on high, you can put your covering on, which is the Pillsbury Crescent Rolls. And you just kind of roll them out, put them in a little circle, um, and then put them right on top of everything in the oven. Um, and they really only need to cook for about 10 to 12 minutes, which is pretty fast. And before you know it, they will be done. Um, when they're a little bit golden brown, you can kind of feel and see that they're done. I put some parsley on top just for, um, just for serving it. And then it's ready to be eaten. And what um, I would do is kind of scoop the stew into bowls and then give everybody one of the little crescent roll tops. Um, so they sort of have like the bread and the stew together. Um, so it's sort of like a deconstructed pot pie. Hope you enjoy.